Hey, good morning to you. Welcome back to the Morning Minute Meditation. Welcome to a brand new week. I was thinking about the devil and his designs for the destruction of every believer's life. Now, he, he can't do much with our soul, as you well know. We are eternally secure through the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. However, he can ruin us and our testimony. I was reading in the book of Ephesians chapter number 4, and the apostle Paul made this statement. He said, neither give place to the devil. He had, just to talk, he had just spoken about lying and other things to keep in check, such as anger. Then he said this, do not leave a space or a place for the devil in your life. It's easy to do that. It, it can be done through various means and measures, and we must needs be careful. We've been warned about the devil. James said, submit yourself therefore to God. Then you're able to resist the devil and have him to flee from you. Uh, the Apostle Peter said that the devil's like a roaring lion. He's walking about seeking whom he may devour. We've been warned about him. But the Apostle Paul says, I have a responsibility to make sure that I don't leave a space or place for the devil in my life. Now, I gave this story to the church on the other day. There was a Haitian who was selling his house, $2,000. A poor man in the community couldn't buy the house, and he requested it but couldn't buy it. And finally negotiating, negotiating, he talked him down to half price. So he sold it for $1,000. But there were two provisos. Number one, if I ever want it back, you must sell it to me. And number two, if, um, if, if you notice above the door, there is this exposed nail. This nail is always mine. Well, several years down the road, he decided he wanted to buy the house back, but the owner wouldn't allow that. So what did he do? He went out and find, found the rotting carcass of a dead dog and hung it on that nail. As a result of that, the putrid odors over the weeks ran the family out of the house and he was able to take the house back. In other words, he, he gave place through that nail to the former owner and it led to his demise. Hey, think about that. Don't give place to the devil by any mean or measure. Hey, have a great day.